Hey guys, welcome to the channel once again and if you've been with me for a while on smartphone tutorials, you would very well know that Pixel Experience is something I really really love. Not because it has a lot of customization but to be honest it doesn't have a lot at all. So this is a ROM which is Pixel Experience and the name itself says it makes your phone look and feel like Pixel and that is the reason I like it a lot. Now the build that we are talking about today is the 23rd or 24th of December build. It's not one of the latest. So the blobs from the official Android Pie update are of course mid missing. But nonetheless we will quickly install it and we will see how does it look on the OnePlus 5 and I'm planning on reviewing it as well. So yes, maybe I'll review it, maybe I'll not. Let me know in the comment section if you want this to be reviewed. But before we do that, if you haven't already, please subscribe and hit that notification bell icon so that you get notified every time I upload a video. At the same time, here's a card to my second channel that is Kratos390. Go ahead and check that channel out as well. Now, without further ado, hello awesome people. Welcome to Smartphone Tutorials. My name is Kalash. Let's see Pixel Experience on the OnePlus 5. Hey guys, welcome to another video and in today's video we are looking at a ROM which I something like about because it looks like Google Pixel phones and it makes your phone look like a Google Pixel as well. So yes, that's correct. This is the OnePlus 5. My name is Kalash and you guys are watching Smartphone Tutorials and yes, we are going to install and preview the latest version of Pixel Experience for this device that is one plus five so first things first usual set of disclaimers you need to make sure that the battery is above 50 percent all your data is backed up and at the same time you need to ensure that twrp is installed for which of course you will need an unlocked bootloader and the rom file which is linked in the description you can download it and copy it to your phone's internal memory now considering that you have taken care of all of these things let's go ahead and start the install process all right so first things first of course we will go to wipe and then we will go to advanced wipe now over here we will select dalvik cache system data we won't be wiping internal storage because we have files in there so swipe to wipe once that is done go to the home screen and go to install pixel experience select that file and swipe to confirm flash now of course this is a rom flash so it will take anywhere between two to five minutes so please be patient while that happens and wait for the flash to complete now after this we won't be flashing g apps because this is pixel experience and this rom comes with google package included inside the rom so the last thing that we will be flashing is the no verity file because this is a decrypted device and i want to keep it that way at the same time i would recommend you to flash the firmware that is the android pie firmware as well so once again go to install select the firmware file and swipe to confirm flash now this will not take a long time because it's basically the android pi firmware and as this pixel experience rom is based on android 9 we need to flash it the last thing that we will flash is go to install flash the no verity treble file so that we can keep the device decrypted now it says patch applied to treble structure so then we will reboot system and do not install now as always this is a first boot so it might take uh, anywhere between five to you know two to five minutes so please be patient while that happens and uh, as i have come to expect google pixel experience rom or the pixel experience rom doesn't have a very very fancy boot animation so we will wait for the phone to boot up and then we can go ahead and check the features all right so as you can see now the phone has booted up so we will quickly skip through the setup part so that i can take you around the rom and you know show you what it looks like and what it feels like on the oneplus 5 so let's quickly go through it all right and just like that we are on the home screen of this wonderful rom now of course this is the google pixel launcher to the left we have the google feed and all the other things now over here we have this particular notification drawer which looks brilliant now overall all in all this is in white and the theme that you see over here in the settings menu as well is the basic pie theme now the good thing or the bad thing whatever you call about this particular rom is that it doesn't have a lot of customization but then again that is how i like it because you will have a lot of roms like resurrection remix msm extended uh, for that matter havoc os which will have customization but this is one rom for the oneplus 5 which concentrates on customization less and it concentrates concentrates more on user experience it just makes your phone feel like a google phone 
so the android version is 9 the security patch is december 2018 so that is good apart from that if i go over here if you go to security and location you have all the usual options and from a first look point of view well it feels very very smooth very very snappy now let's see what are the applications that we have in this particular rom so we do have oneplus cam included now this feels like uh, it is one of the older versions because i do not see the portrait option over here which is fine but nonetheless we have the oneplus camera application in this particular rom and it works just fine apart from that we have a few basic apps like calculator calendar and stuff and all in all it is a very very minimalistic rom and feels really really fast and snappy now as you can see the transition animations are the basic android pie animations apart from that if you go to settings you have digital well-being which is a part of android pie although this thing is not available in oxygen os but yes in this particular rom and in a lot of other custom roms this feature is available so all in all if you want a rom which is not oxygen os but has almost similar camera clarity compared to the stock rom well, I guess you can go ahead and install Google Pixel Experience ROM for the OnePlus 5 and 5T as well. It's available for that device as well. And it will give you a very, very minimalistic experience. What are the issues and what are not? Well, I'll go ahead and check that and I'll get back to you on that in the full review. But for now, this is Kalash signing off at Smartphone Tutorials. Until the next one, keep smiling. Take care. Goodbye.